There are a couple of great new enhancements to shared actions in the new version of Adobe Captivate. They're fairly simple to understand. Now you can take a shared action directly from the library and drag that shared action onto a basic button. So let's start by creating a simple shared action based on an advanced action. I'll go to project and then I'll pull up the advanced actions. Here you can see that I have an advanced action called count, just a very simple kind of doodad. It happens to have some variables and other elements in it. I'm going to save that as a shared action and we'll call this count shared just so we know that that's the shared action. Now here you can see I have the option to actually allow the use of these parameters. This one is a variable, we'll call this variable one. This one is also a variable, we'll call it variable two. And you can use this to do things like store flags and pass them across projects so you don't have to recreate them. This just happens to be an integer. Now all of these parameters are things that you can store inside your Captivate project. So we'll call this variable three. And this is just a prompt that you use to let yourself know that these are the elements in your project. And then finally, I happen to call to hide a specific object or item on the screen. So we'll just call this item to hide, all right? Once you're done, hit the little return key on the edge of each and then click save. And now we've created our shared action based on an advanced action and it includes all of the materials, including the parameters that were in the original. Now, in order to apply that, all I have to do is just find it in my library. You can see there it is, count shared. And then I just drag it over and drop it on the button. And just like that, I'm ready to create my variable. You see, I can pull up any of the variables that happen to exist in the system. I can uh, change them, reset them. Here in this case, I have a variable called one. So I can just use that variable just like that. And I can do the same thing with two and so on. So lickety split, I've created a shared action that I can use and reuse throughout all of my projects. Enjoy.